Hi, I'm Bill with Phoenix Golf, and today we're going to talk about some setup things in the golf swing. Your setup is so important because if you can prevent something from happening, then you don't have to fix it. One of the things over the years that I've come across, which uh, I battled when I was younger and uh, have gotten better at, now, unfortunately, it's kind of where your arms are when you start, and I see a lot of people do this, so, you know, especially a bigger chested guy like me, so what they do is they take their setup and their arms are right on their sides. They're not, their arms aren't in front of their chest, they're on the sides. So as you can see, if they're on my side, I kind of have to squat down too far, I think, to squat down. And as I take the club back, you'll see how low my arm is. My arm should be up here. It's low because that's as far as I can go. And my right elbow gets trapped behind my body. So then what happens is as I go down, I have to flip at the club to hit it because my arm is stuck. Um, I can't go anywhere. So you don't really get a good turn either. And, and honestly, it feels like you just, it's not a very powerful swing. So here's what I feel you should do with the arms to help you get a better setup and better contact with the ball. So what I do, instead of having my arms beside me, I take the club uh, in my uh, lead hand and I raise out and straighten my arms out and try to get my elbows close together like this, and then I just let the club fall to the ground. So you should feel like your arms are in front of your chest, not beside you, in front of, and your elbow should be closer than this. This is bad, this is good. If, imagine if you're like holding one of those balls, chore striker balls or something in between your arms, it keeps your elbow and your body working together. So when my arms are together, you can see as I take the club back, my right elbow is still inside my body. It's not out here. And my left arm is right across this top here where it's covering my trail shoulder. So now when I go down, I have room to swing and drive through the ball versus if my arms were on my side, now I'm stuck here and I have to flip like this. So again, what I recommend, especially for even every golfer, but especially bigger chested guys like me, Stretch out your arms, get your elbows close, let the club come down, and you'll feel a huge difference as you take the club weight. It'll feel more free and it'll feel more connected. And then it'll allow you to drive through the ball. So I highly recommend that. Doing that type of setup before you even hit the golf ball is so important. And I think it'll allow you to hit the ball much, much better and you'll have more solid strikes and better scores. So if you like these tips and videos, please like and subscribe. I really appreciate it.